What's up guys, Inkle Spankin here, and today we are playing as Gragas in the Jungle. And, I decided I would bust out some Gragas Jungle, see if I could do it for you guys, because I have noticed this has been rather popular recently. Um, I don't know, I don't, I mean, it's obviously strong, or else it wouldn't be popular, right? Uh, I personally have not tried it myself, um, but I've seen it quite a few times, and I decided, hey, Let's give it a shot, right? So we'll see how this goes. Using my uh, my super fan Gragas skin here. And, I mean, I just decided this one, you know, good luck. You know, got a little nipple there. And, you know, that's really all you need when you're playing some Gragas. You just need some nipple. Anyways, going to uh, sit here, grab our W first, our Drunken Rage. And I guess I'm going to start at my, whatever this thing is, the Gromp. Going to start at the Gromp. Um... Because, I mean, I, I kind of would like to start up here, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, just going to do the standard jungle clear and see if we can get some ganks off. I don't think, um, I don't think I'm going to be doing a level 2 gank, so I think I'll just get my barrel roll at level 2. And we could try and go for a level 3 gank, maybe, but their lanes are kind of tough to gank. Um, Olaf would probably be my best bet if I can get some ganks off before he's 6 for Swain. But Vlad... Vlad is kind of an awkward person to gank. Uh, same with Ezreal. Because Ezreal, you know, obviously you can just flip-flop on out of there. Thank you for the pinging. Um, Ezreal can flip-flop out. And wow, that was a big bop. Let's go ahead and smite that, though. And just keep up the autos. Um, Karma has her speed buff, though. Like I said, Ezreal can arcane shift out. Vlad can pull out. So, I mean, there's just like a bunch of things that can go horribly wrong in these ganks. So, it's good things, just just things to keep in mind when you're ganking for people. Let's go ahead and drop W here. Mwah. Smack it. Wow, that does a lot of damage. Holy shit. Alright, well, let's grab this, or finish grabbing this. And, yeah, there we go. Get both of those, that'll be the blue secured. Let's go over and run to our red real fast, just straight to it. And we'll see what we can do then. So it looks like Olaf hasn't shown up yet. He could be going for a jungle camp, which I wouldn't put it past Olaf. Because um, Olaf would be good at doing that. But at the same time, I'm a little confused that Olaf would be doing it because Olaf doesn't have teleport. So, if he were to be doing that, I'd be a little surprised. And I forgot to, uh, you know, let my barrel charge up. So, my mistake, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and just chug back. Give it a big ol' smack on the jaw, and boop, there we go, that'll be the red going down. And we'll auto that one once, the red will kill it, auto that one once, red will kill it as well. And Olaf is still not back, where are you, Olaf? Oh, Olaf. Olaf, where are you? Bop, there we go, just go ahead and body slam into these guys. And it's looking like, yep, my, uh, bop, whatever my buff is, my, uh, my gromp smite buff will be taking their lives. So let's go ahead and just drop the barrel roll over here, and we'll see what we can do. So to my knowledge, the reason this works so well is because Gragas is a, you know, as a champion can pump out such, such massive uh, crowd control. So that's you know the big reason it works so well. Let's just see if we can get a gank off on this guy. So it looks like oh wait wait the dragon already going down. So Udir, the dragon is at ten minutes, and let's just. Maybe I can get a maybe I can get a gank off here or something. It's looking like he's pretty healthy. If if Swain can push, I'll just go ahead and see if we can dive this guy. So I'll wait right here, and it's looking like oh, okay. Oh yeah, bop, boink. <laughs> Pick up the kill, super easy. Um, I did not think Swain would be close enough in his face that he would die. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, minion's almost killing me, but let's see there, so, wait, I should push this out as hard as I can, because whatever his face isn't, you know, he doesn't have teleport, so I should be pushing this, like, but I should be pushing harder than a pregnant lady right now, like, bop, alright, come on, there we go, that'll be some, uh, some good gold under my belt, good gold, good experience, and that'll deny Olaf of a decent amount as well, and also reset the lane for Swain, or it should reset the lane, assuming I pushed quickly enough. So let's see, we'll go ahead and grab that, we'll grab some boots, we'll grab a piece of our Cinder Hulk, and then we'll grab a couple potions as well. 
And I think we'll swap to the sweeping lens already. So a decent back right there. Uh, gain a kill and gain some lane minions should be pretty good for us. And actually, even though Udyr did secure an early dragon, that should set him behind on his clear. Granted, it is Udyr, so he's going to have really, really fast clear naturally. But still, doing dragon that early does inherently set you behind. So Swain, come on, homie, what are you doing? It's okay. It happens, so we'll go ahead and just take a drink of our cast there. Just pop him right there with the barrel. And I I actually... I think leveling up the barrel first is the right thing to do. But I'm not totally sure. But we'll find out. So, I mean, I, I, I'm pretty sure it is because of the super increase on the slow. But we'll see if we can get a gank off on this guy here. I do not have my flash, so that's one thing to keep in mind. But let's just see if we can do anything here. So he rushed CDR boots. Let's go ahead and just pop. Okay. Well, that'll be his pool going down. Easy peasy. And I'll just walk away. So let's see. Maybe I can get a gank off on bottom. Maybe. I don't know. Why don't you take this thing? That would be a good idea. Yeah! Smack it with the might of our cask. And maybe... Wait, maybe I can just... Oh, he's level 6. Now, I don't, I don't know if I want it. Do I want it, guys? I don't know. I can't really tell. Alright, pop! Go ahead and get the scuttle crab. And let's use our mana potion that we have real fast, too. So I'm going over here. It's looking like there could be some aggression going on down there. I should keep an eye down there. And hi -ya. Smack those guys. Smack that. Smite it real fast. It looks like Rai's picking up a kill on the Vlag. Good job there, buddy. Will be a kill off for them. Um, Let's see. When's my buffs up? So our blue's up in 30 seconds. I can kind of chill around there um, and wait till I can get that. Because there's not really anything I want to get done around the map right now. I could come bottom and kind of show myself just see if I can uh, apply a little pressure just, you know, by being like, hey, I'm here. Um, and that's really all it takes sometimes. Like, if you can just show your face, that's enough on its own to scare people away pretty frequently. So that was about the best use of my time I can think of. Uh, maybe a better use of my time could have been pushing this. I don't know. Um, but my Gromp like, just spawned, so I don't think there was a whole lot I could have really done there. Uh, truthfully, there would have been a better use of my time. So I'm going to wait a little bit here. It's looking like I'm going to have to camp top pretty hard, I guess. So I may end up focusing on that. Um, if I can get a successful gank off bottom, that would be fantastic. It looks like Ezreal... Trying to do some stuff here, but let's see if I can charge in and be like, nah, son. Right, I'm going to go ahead and take a sip. So let's see. Boop, smack him on the jaw there. Go ahead and just do this. Knock them both backwards. And that's going to be the flash out from Ezreal. There's his heal. That's going to be one kill. And let's see the bop. That'll be the bop right there. And boop, boink. There is a successful gank. That should get bot lane the advantage they need for sure. So Draven cashing in on quite a few stacks there, I'm sure of that. And let's see if we can do some good stuff up here. Using the ultimate to push, not a bad choice indeed. Let's pick up the entire Cinder Hulk, and we'll go ahead and grab a Mana Potion. And now bot lane should definitely be winning. Mid lane should definitely be doing pretty well. Rise, he has a kill. He is up on CS, and he's got both of his stacking items. Basically, all I should try and do right now is see if I can focus on top. And the good thing is, actually, it's a full damage... Olaf. Now, we do need to be mindful that because of that, Olaf will do a shit ton of damage, and a lot of people really do underestimate just how much damage Olaf does, because uh, it's pretty damn scary sometimes. But, that also means that he's not going to be very tanky, and hopefully I can kill him before he gets too out of control on this swain. So let's see, maybe I can pick up a kill here. Oh, I definitely should be able to. I definitely should be able to. I'm going to go ahead and take a sip from my cask. We'll drop our barrel right there and... Wooja! Smack him in the jaw right there. Get this red buff going and let's go ahead and see if maybe I can do something here. And... I... Ja! Whoa! Got him! So this will be... Boink! Bop him right there. Just keep bopping him. He ain't going to be able to win. Alright, he's totally winning. He's totally winning. That was ridiculous. That was ridiculous. That was actually ridiculous. Alright. Well, I, I know he has built-in lifesteal, but I didn't think it would be as much as it was. Honestly. I really, really didn't. So, even I underestimated Olaf's strength. 
Maybe I overestimated Gragas' damage, too. So, that sucks. <laughs> that sucks a lot. Um, so, it's time to revamp our plans here. Maybe it would be a better idea for me to say fuck Swain. Because he's so monumentally far behind right now. And if Olaf continues to go straight damage, then it'll be really easy target for the rest of my team to kill him really quickly. That's the other alternative here, because apparently... I thought I did more damage than I actually do, and that just got me fucking dunked. Um, so that's a little awkward. So let's see, maybe it's looking like they're probably gonna get another kill down there. So if I want to kill this Olaf, oh man, oh boy, I think my real only hopes for killing him will be if I get like a three-man gank off up there so let's see maybe I can do this thing so looks like Draven picking up a kill I'm gonna see if I can do this dragon it shouldn't be too hard um, let's go ahead and just use our drunken rage smack it for wow decent amount of damage and just body slam it a bit yeah this is actually proven to be pretty easy the bot lane turret will be going down let's make sure we're using our potion here and this definitely should be a pretty easy dragon going down now I know it sounds weird but Usually, <laughs> regardless of what I was saying earlier, let me just clarify this right now. When I was saying that I should try and gank... Oh, come on. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. All right, let's see. Let's see here. Can I do this? Wait. There's no way I'm going to be able to make it past these freaking things. Not without bopping them. So let's see if I can get this guy... And woo! Whoa, I missed. That's awkward. Alright. Hey! Da! Wait! Oh god, I'm so weak. I'm so weak. I am so weak. What the hell? How do people do so much damage with this champion? <laughs> I get why he's a good jungler. He's just like this tanky menace. But how are people so damaging on him? How do people do so much damage with this guy? I mean, I'm sure a big part of it is probably not missing your abilities, but is it, there's got to be something I'm doing wrong, maybe. <laughs> like, I mean something outside of that that I'm probably doing wrong, and I'm not, not totally sure what it is. Oh, well. Let's go ahead and grab uh, these bad boys right here. I think that this ruby crystal of mine is going to be building straight into a righteous glory. Because as far as I know, that is, like, the big item that all Gragas's get. So, I'm assuming, going off on a limb here, I am totally assuming that everything that makes Gragas so good right now is along the lines of Cinderhulk and his innate tankiness with his W, um, along with his massive amount of displacement capabilities. Because um, he does percentage health with his W, so it makes it a good big old bop. But he's just so tanky. Like, <laughs> he is so tanky, and he has so much uh, CC and slow built into his kit. So I'm assuming that, that all that stuff combined into one champion is what makes him so good right now. So let's go ahead and just slow this down a bit. I'm going to go ahead and give this guy a bop. And I haven't really used my sweeper for much, so bop. Go ahead and drop it there, and boop. Let it charge up as much as I can, that'll be the end of that. So let's see, Swain is... Okay, well he got a blasting wand. Alright, so this is effectively not going to be a very strong game for Swain, I have a feeling. Uh, but this will be the tower going down for sure. That didn't really do a whole lot of damage to me. And let's see if we can... Whoa, maybe... Ooh. Alright, there's True Shot Barrage going to tickle me a little bit. Tickle me in ways I'm not quite familiar with. Arg! He hurts a little bit. Wait, why did I just... <laughs> <laughs> Why did I just go full pirate mode? Alright, whatever. Let's go ahead and run over here and get the red. Still 2-1-1. One one. Haven't really gotten anything uh, off other than those two early ganks that really went well for my mid and bot lane. So... You know, to be honest... Wait, no. Did I even do anything for mid? Okay, so that gank I got off for bot lane is basically my shining moment. The star point of my career. Uh, and let's go ahead and let that charge up. Bop! Bop. There we go. Big bops. And after I take this... Boop. There we go. 
go. That should go away now. Let's see if I can get a sick ass engage off on these guys. So, hey, yeah, I am here. Wait, I'm gonna be annoying. Ha ha, got him. <laughs> he never saw it coming. So let's go ahead and just oh, BM, BM. He says, all right. Wait, that's a little Gatorade thing, isn't it? Nice. Hey, yeah, got him. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can get like a five-man gank off on this Olaf. That's about to be the only thing that works. And the main problem is, since we have so much AP on our... Whoa! Uh-oh! Alright, hit! Whoop! Smacking him that way! That'll be the stun! There's the kill! And that will be the end of their lives. I'm not sure if that flash was necessary, but did anyways, and it brought a successful gank. Or counter gank. Counter initiation! Death. It brought death. Oh, I Oh. Eh. Damn. Oh, that's going to be the whirling death picking it up. I like it. So just take a chug, take a sip, and boop, slow him down a decent chunk there. Ah, the tower. Ah, the GT's the tower. All right, you know what? You guys are probably fine. Um, yeah? Okay, they're probably not fine. Okay, they're not fine at all. Everyone's dying. Everyone's dying. Draven's not even gonna get killed all right you know what they're probably fine they probably have the entire situation under control so I'm just gonna get the catalyst and I'll grab another ruby crystal this will build into the righteous glory and we'll see where we go from here let's see what's Swain doing oh is Swain oh he's got that kill the dots the dots Swain picking up some money picking up some worth for his name I'm not sure that's a totally good thing but we'll say it's a good thing the never move will totally miss so it never never land and let's see if we can... Okay, so I don't really understand what the uh, what the little do's and don'ts of Gragas are. It doesn't seem like I can use any of my abilities when I'm taking a sip. So that's, I mean, that's one thing to keep in mind. We'll go ahead and just fly on over here and boop, clear out this. My blue will be up in a uh, minute and the dragon will be up in about 10 seconds. So let's see, is there a ward in here? hi -ya! All right, we should go for this dragon. So, that's up in five seconds. So, Swain, oh, oh, he's running Ignite too. Icky, icky. Don't run Ignite, man. That's icky. All right, let's see if we can do this. Ha ha! So I don't even give a hoot that they're watching us do this shit. Cause you know why? I don't give a hoot. Zero hoot, son. So let's go ahead and just see if we can do this. And boop. wait, team. Oh no. Oh no. All right, it's okay. It's all good. It's all good. All right. Whee! <laughs> Am I out? I might not be out, team. Right, I'm probably out. I'm probably not out. Hey, yeah. Wait, I'm out. Peace. <laughs> oh, the return kill on Karma. We'll be picking up a kill there. And let's see if we can. Boop. Alright, I'll just toss barrels from a distance and make them admire my bowling skills. Whoa, the snare, the lockup from Rise. And it's looking like the Beatrice is getting pissed. Beatrice is the name of Swain's bird, by the way, if you did not know that. So there's the old fun fact of the day. But let's go ahead and run over here, grab the blue real fast. Rizu, do you want this? Rise? Rise? Do you want this, Rise? It looks like he does. All right, we'll give it to him. We'll play ball. Hey, yeah. Whoa, that bopped it really hard. Okay, good. Okay, Rise got it. We're good. I was gonna say, damn, that drunken rage hits like a truck. Did not see that coming entirely. Let's see. Boop. Some big damage off there. I am getting to the point where my health is really, really beneficial for me to have the Gromp buff in these fights now. So that's another thing to keep in mind. I'm actually going to do one more camp because I didn't realize just how close I am to that Righteous Glory. So we'll go ahead and just throw our barrel there and... Whoa! Smack it all with our face. And let's see. All right, good job, Gragas. And one more bop. There we go. We can go get the entire Righteous Glory now. Looks like our team is pushing down mid lane turrets as well, so that's good for us. And now, Righteous Glory achieved. So I have 2,600 health already. And, like, no defenses, but I like that. I like my style. So I think next up, I will probably be going for... 
I'm feeling a frozen heart. I think that would be a good idea. And then maybe a spear visage, possibly, because Gragas does have a lot of healing inside his kit. Um, so that could be a good choice. It also gives CDR, also gives, you know, MR, of course, all the good stuff that comes along with the item. So there's lots of things to keep in mind there. I'm just not exactly sure what every greatest choice would be, you know? So, just trying to think it all through, because I don't want to give you guys a horrible display, even though I'm not totally sure what I'm doing. It def definitely does feel like Grogs' early games are super strong, though. So, oh, well, that's not good. I'm going to be losing that tower, but that's okay. Oh, uh-oh, wait. All right, no Ragnarok coming out today. I was going to say, if, if that Olaf pops his ultimate uh, and breaks all the CC, I'll be there. Let's see the Tibbers coming out, and that will be the, ooh, Draven. Picking up another kill. No problemo. And that will be, ooh, maybe, maybe. Is he going to get in range? The speed buff will get him in range. That'll be the kill. And hi -ya! All right, there goes his... Oh! Yeah! Smack him on the mouth there! Get back here, bitch! Get back here, bitch! That's gonna be the kill off on you, Dyer. Wait, Olaf? Olaf is dead. Olaf is dead. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, don't make me look like a fool again, Olaf. You're pretty good at that, but don't do it again. So, Olaf is dead. Draven has done it. And... I bet we could dive that guy. No problem. No problem. So I'll go ahead and just run in here. I can I can pop the Righteous Glory as well. We can just charge after this guy if he gets near us. So, oh, motherfucker! Alright, well, she flashed out. Whoa, Rise still doing a very hefty amount of damage. Now, let's see, that'll be the W coming out. Nothing coming out of it, though. Draven, standing his ground, fighting like a man. Let's go ahead and just grab this tower while we can. So that's good for us. And, boosh! Oh, I missed. Whatever. I'm the fucking best. Wait, Draven? Are you sure about this, buddy? I think we should back off. Draven! Draven? 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 Oh dear, stop it! Wait. Hi. E yeah! Whoa! <laughs> did not see that one coming. I did not expect him to go even further ham for that. So let's see. Boop. Go ahead and smite this. hi yeah! Clear that all right quick. And I can grab the Rift Scuttler as well, methinks. I think that would be a good idea. Good choice. Whoa, wait, what? Are you guys okay? Oh, you guys are totally fine. Maybe? Maybe? Uh, yeah. Ugh. Dang it. Wait, she has a Righteous Glory too? Double Righteous Glory? Double the Righteousness? Double the Glory? Or is it is it multiplicative? Does it stack? Is it like quadruple Righteousness and Glory? I don't know. Oh, no. All right. Hey ya! Hey! Alright, well I guess there goes exhaust, there goes a whole lot of stuff on me. And let's see, there's this guy, there's this guy! There's this guy, team! There's this guy! Alright, slowed him down. Hey ya! That'll be the end of your... Ugh! Get into that wall, bitch! The Ragnarok coming out! And let's see, can we get him? That'll be the Yomus coming out, and... Oh, dang. Alright, popping the Righteous Glory it doesn't pop when I'm... Okay. It does not pop when I'm drinking. Today I learned. It does... <laughs> you can't do fucking anything when you're drinking. <laughs> Got it. Got it. Let's see. Is there blue up? If it is, I want it. Dang it. It's not. Alright. Well, I might as well... Hey! <laughs> Good job, team! But since, they're, uh, since their blue is not up, and I need to go back soon anyways, due to my total lack of mana, I might as well come clear all this top farm, uh, and then go back. Because if I try and do much of anything right now, there's not really bound to be a whole lot for me to do. So let's go ahead and just smack that, E that, and my team is fighting. But Draven is on a rampage, so that's good. Uh, keep it up, Dre. Up, oh, Draven got yeah, a double kill. Keep it up, Draven. All right, Swain, you got this. Actually, Swain's doing a fantastic job, all things considered. He had a very, very rough early game, and he definitely, definitely brought it back. So, you know what? I am proud of the little bugger. I am very proud of him. So let's go ahead and grab a pink here, just for the sake of having a pink. Rise will be grabbing that blue. Go for it, buddy! Do it up! Do it up! And the dragon's up, so we should definitely have our eyes set on that. Draven, I mean, he's not, you know, he's not like weak. 
But I'm sure he has a lot of money to go spend. And I think he should go spend it. Because if he goes and spends that money, that'd be pretty good. But we could also, on the flip side, do this dragon really fast with Draven at my side. So, he's going to just start this. That's fine. We'll go ahead and just smack it with our face and BOP! Oh, I don't know if he did that on purpose, but he actually let me get the kill on it, so that was a little nice of him. So we'll assume he did it on purpose, and this Draven's just a super, super nice guy. Because uh, I like I like thinking the best of people that I can. So, da! Go ahead and grab that. Easy money. And it looks like Vlad could be in a pickle here. Alright, the Disintegrate coming out. And, oof! Oof! Oh, maybe. Maybe. Uh, uh, get off of her! Ah, uh, it didn't work. Uh-oh. Alright. Alright. Did I get the slow? Heck, get off of him! No! I didn't save him. Oh. Stop it! Bully, wait, wait! Nope, not gonna land. <laughs> ah, I tried to be as touchy peely as I could, but you know, I could only be as touch. You know, I could only be so touchy peely. So, Draven, you should get that red, buddy. You should go get that red, buddy. Maybe I can get the. Uh, uh, yeah! All right, maybe I can get uh, get enough money for whatever that is. My frozen heart, because that'll give me um, actually a lot of CDR that I don't have right now. It'll give me twenty percent. Um, that'll take a lot of a lot of time off of my abilities actually. So if I can get all this bot farm, that oh, Swain's going for it. All right, we're gonna share it, Swain, because I need some of this money too. Hey, how much how much farm does he have? Oh, I'm keeping up with Swain. Alright. Hey, yippa! Hey, I got some of it. I'm the best. Alright, let's see if we... Oh, smite Gromp, you're right! Thank you for reminding me, loyal and faithful viewer! I forgot to smite the Gromp. And Draven's a beast. Okay. I don't know what he's doing, but he's a beast. So let's see. Maybe I can grab these wolves and have enough money when I go back to... <laughs> I'm looking forward to this. I'm looking forward to this, and I do have enough money for my Frozen Heart. So anyways, the reason we smite the Gromp, by the way, is because it does do more damage. Uh, the Gift of the Toadstool is what it's called. Uh, but it does do more damage than it used to now, and what it does is it, func or it functions similarly to a Thornmail, where when people hit you, they actually take damage in return. But it used to be damage based off what level you were, but now it's based off of your maximum health. So the more HP you have, the more damage it does. Like right now, it's already doing 76 damage over 3 seconds. When I only have uh, a, a little less than 3,000 health. So that's actually, you know, quite a lot of damage from just smiting something. Um, if you ask me, I think at least. So let's see. Can we dive this? Their turret's still up. I don't know if we should dive. So I do have my frozen heart, though. So let's go ahead and just. Whoa! Maybe? And. What the? Boosh! Get back here, boys! Get back here, boy! Alright, I'm gonna flash out. Do not want. Maybe I do want. I do not want. Oh, the exhaust coming out, but the whirling death thing is not gonna land. <laughs> not gonna land. Not gonna land. And... Oh, it was all calculated from the very beginning, it seems. And that will be the end of his life as well. Let's go ahead and slow him down. Bop! Get the big old bop off in here, and that'll be another kill for the Draven, putting him at legendary. And that will be the surrender vote Draven going ham this game and that was beautiful so that early gank was totally worth totally worth <laughs> totally worth he complimented us so that means we're we're good right right something like that let's look at these post game stats here real fast for you guys though so 4 1 and 4 there's my ending build there's my ending monies there's my ending farm there's everyone's ending monies and everything um Overall, everyone did very well. We had a very, uh, very speedy team with two righteous glories and a uh, and a uh, talisman of ascension. So interesting. But let's see here. The damage done. Yes. Did I do the least on the team? No, I did a hundred more than Annie. Woo! And I did. Uh, let's see. I did like two thousand six hundred more in the the new deer. Yeah. Way to go, me. So overall, still did pretty well. I think for my first time on playing Gragas Jungle, I didn't do that bad. Overall, I mean, I could have obviously done much better, but I don't think I did that bad. Anyways, <laughs> next video also will probably come as a surprise to a lot of you guys, too. 
But if you guys enjoyed this video, though, make sure you like and favorite it me out. If you want, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Twitch, and my second channel. for links will be in the description below. And as always, I love you guys. It'll be a wonderful day. Peace!